Welcome guys. Let's look at the next question on the board as regarding to table log. My name remains Chidiberi Christian, your lead mathematics teacher for Premier Mill Academy. Now what we'll do here, we start the former class we said for the first one, we'll take the first, that becomes what? Becomes 36 for the number point what? 1, 5. Right? And first of all, we said we look for the word, we look for the characteristics. That becomes one point. And if you check the, uh, look at the screen, you will see the table, uh, the logarithm table on your screen there. Check for 36 under 1. 36 under 1. What did you get? 36 under 1. If you check, you will discover we got 5, 5, 7, 5. Right? What about the difference of 5? Because what we have here is 36 under 1, difference 5. And if you check your WC table, you will see that the difference 5 is what? It's 6. Right? Even 5 is 6. So what do we do? We add each and every one of them. We add the numbers. Right? So 6 plus 5 is 11. Right? than 1 carry 1. This is 7 plus 1. That becomes 8. This is 5, 5. So the mantis are is 5, 5, 8, 1. So for me, we'll put in 5, 5, 8, 1. That's the first one. Now for the second one, it's 1, 1. 1, 1 point what? 2, 4. Right? So we look for logarithm of 11 under 2. If you check your log table, you see that logarithm of 11 should be what? We discover it is 0, 4, 9, 2. Log 11 under 2. Log 11 under 2 is 0, 4, 9, 2. The difference of 4 should be what? We discover that the difference of 4, the difference of 4 is 15. And so we add. Right? 2 plus 5 is 7. This is 10. Carry 1. 1 plus 4 is 5. And this is 0. So it's 0, 5, 0, 7 as the mantis are. Uh, originally, we know that from here, we're picking one, right? It's one point, what? Uh, zero, five, what? Zero, seven, right? So what do we do to this? Because we are multiplying, if you check, because we are multiplying, there's a multiplying sign here. Because we are multiplying these both of them, this and this, we'll add them here. Right? So we'll add them here. And if we add them, what do we have? Check from here, let's add together. Let me use another marker for my answer, my results. That's why I'm putting results here. 1 plus 7. 1 plus 7 is 8. I hope you are seeing the board. 1 plus 7 is 8. Right? 8 plus 0 is 8. Also, 5 plus 5 is 10. Right on 0. Carry 1. Put the 1 here. 1 plus 5 should be what? 6. When 1 plus 1 is what? Is 2. That's the result. Right? So what do we do? Let's try and take this one off. Let's cover this guy off. So we look for a way to cover this guy off. That's the answer for the first one, right? What about for the second one, the denominator? That's for the numerator. This guy is for the new numerator, right? Let's look for the denominator. Now with the denominator, we come here and put 42 under 2, right? So 42.21. So like we, uh, like we said, we have to move this on one place, that means this one point. If you check your logarithm table, log of 42 under 2 is what? Check the screen, is there. Look at the screen, log 42 under 2 is what? If you check, it is 6, 2, 5, 3, right? Log 42 under 2 is 6, 2, 5, 3. The difference of 1 should be what? Check the log table, you see the difference of 1 is, is 1. It's 1, so we put in 1 here, right? 1 plus 3 is 4, this is 5, this is 2, and this is 6. Alright, so we come here and put 6, 2, 5, 4. That's for the first one. The other one we have 32.5. 32.5, right? And so we move this side 1, it's 1 times, we move the ones, so it's 1 point what? 32 under 5 should be what? On your log table, look at your log table. 32 under 5 should be what? It is 5, 1, 1, 9. It is 2 under 5. If you check, look at this question. Now, we don't have a difference. There's no difference because it's just three numbers. So, it is 32 under 5. 5, 1, 1, 9. So, we just put in 5, 1, 1, 9 here. And if you watch the denominator here, they are multiplying. So, if we multiply here, we're going to add with the log, right? Simply, what we'll do is just to add, right? Let's add with the other marker. Let's use the other marker to add. So by addition, we have that 9 plus 4 is 13, put in 3, carry 1, and then 5 plus 1 is 6, plus that one, that's what? That should be 7. 
right? And then 2 plus 1 is how many? It's 3. And then 6 plus 5 is how many? 11. Add that 1, point carry 1. 1 plus 1 is 2, plus that one should be what? Should be 3. Yes, that's our answer. Let me try and put here off. Please. Put here off. So what happens? You discover that uh, this is the numerator of this and the denominator of this, right? But they are dividing, right? They are dividing. If you divide them, what do you mean? It means that the answer here will subtract the answer from this one. Subtract this answer from this one. So therefore, it is 36.15 times what? 11.24 over what? Over 42.21 times 32.5. That means, that means we are what? We are subtracting this answer from this one. That's that. Subtracting these two answers. Therefore, we'll come and say uh, 2.6 eight eight minus three point one three seven three discover it is minus zero point five two eight five that's what we got All right this is our result main answer i haven't subtracted it but that's not all what we'll do now is to look for the antilog come here and look for the antilog there's an antilog table uh, after the logarithm step, we'll look for antilog of point 0.52 under 8 difference 5 should be what? Look for look at your log table there. Antilog of point 0.52 under 8 is what? You discover it is 3, 3, 7, 3. The difference of 5 should be what? You discover it is 4. When we add, we got 7 here, 7 here, 3, 3. So it's 3, 3, 7, seven so the antilog of this is simply three three seven seven but now we have a minus here some people call it bar or they call it minus so what do we do if we add one to zero what happens what do we get adding one to zero one minus zero should be what should be one is that simple so, because we're always adding one to the characteristics of the antelope, right? If we add one, from here we are subtracting one, from here we are adding one to the antelope. So, if we add one to zero, what do we have? We just have one. So, we'll move one times. So, from here, we just move one to the point. So, our answer simply becomes, our answer becomes 3.377. That's the answer to this question on the board. What did we do? First of all, we took the log of this and the log of this and then we added them to get their result. The same thing happened to the denominator. Took the log of this and this. After their log, we got their result and then we subtracted. That's everything here. We subtracted the answer from this. This is the first answer. Subtract this answer to get this. And then we look, the, look for the antilog. This is the antilog. Antilog of this answer. 0.52 under 8 difference 5. And then we're adding 1 to this minus 0. It is 1. 1 minus 0 should be 1. And then we'll move one time. That gives us 3.377. I'm sure you understand what we just did. And in case you don't understand, you still want us to water it down. You can go to the comment section and then let us know that you want us to explain what you want us to explain. Or you send the number directly to my WhatsApp number on the screen there. I'll be sure to take all your questions and give all the answers you want me to give to you. In the next video, we'll be solving the next question to see how we can get all these details. Thank you very much, guys. Premium Hill Academy. Morality, ingenuity, and excellence at its peak. All right, guys. Let's look at the question number two on the board. It says, find using the table log. Using table, provide the solution for this question. It's 204. 82. For the numerator, we have first one was 82.41. So, our characteristics for me, we move one here. One went. We move once, right? So, let's look at log 82 under 4. On the screen, you see the log written table, right? So let's look at log 82 under 4 should be what? Log 82 under 4. 9159. Right? And what about the difference? Difference 1 should be what? If you check, you discover that difference 1 is 1. It's just 1. So if we add this, we'll have 0, 10. Adding 1 to here, that will be 6. This is 1, 9. Answer is 9160. From here, we'll come and put 91. Six zero in the mantisar. Right, that's for the first one. And then the second log is seventy six. Seven six point what five two. 
right? On doing this, we'll first of all find our characteristics by moving ones, our characteristics, and then we'll look, we'll look for log 76 under 5. That should be 8, 8, 3, 7. What about difference 2? If you check the difference of 2, there should be what? Difference 2 is simply 1. What we'll do is to add. That's 8, 3, 8, 8. So we'll come here and put 8, 3, 8, 3, 8, 8. Right? This is the first thing we'll do. And because they are multiplying, because they are multiplying, what we'll simply do here is to add. So if we add, what becomes our answer? 0 plus 8 should be 8. And then 8 plus 6 should be 14. And then 4, carry 1. 3 plus 1 is 4, because the one we carry, that should be 5. Right? And 9 plus 8 should be what? 17. Right? And 7, carry 1. There's a point here. 1 plus 1 is 2, plus our 1 is 3. Right? That's for the numerator. So what do we do with that? We try to rule off. This rules off. Sorry, my line is a bit bent. Right? Very sorry. So uh, the next is to have this, right? We we'll have as our denominator. Now, denominator we have seven point eight three nine. Seven point eight three nine. So, uh, because if we move one, we just have one number. If we move one, that should be what? That should be zero point. We're not moving anything. Actually, it's still here, so we're not moving anything. So we we'll look for logarithm of seventy eight under three on your logarithm table on the board. Log seventy eight under three should be what? If you check, you discover it is 8, 9, 3, 8. And the difference of 9 should be what? You discover the difference of 9 is 5. So we add, right? On adding, 8 plus 5 is 13. So we put in 3, carry 1. 1 plus 3, that should be 4. We have 9 and we have 8. So from here, the matrix are here should be 8, 9, 4, 3. Right? And because they are not adding anything, we are not adding in this case, our result will be the same. 0 0.8943. Right? This is our result. Let's try and stroke this denominator off so that we can continue what we have. Stroking this out. Yes, we have this. Right? So what do we do next? We are going to add, or we are going to subtract because we are subtracting the numerator from the denominator. We are subtracting the numerator from the denominator. So let me put the question back. What we have there was 82.41 times 76.52, all of 7.839. You see the numerator is subtracting the denominator, right? So that means we are going to have 3 3.7, 3.7548. Minus 0.8943. And using your calculator to subtract this, what do you have? That you will get 2.8605. This is the total result of what we had, right? So from here, we'll look for the antilog. We take the antilog of this one, antilog. So we'll look for antilog of 0.86 under 0. What's the antilog of 0.86 on your screen? You will look at it on your screen. Antilog of 0.86 under 0. That will give us what? Difference 5 on that will be 8. So what we'll do simply is to add, right? 4 plus 8 will give us 12. Add that 2, carry 1. Adding the 1 to this 4. 1 plus 4, that should be 5. We have 2 here and we have 7. So our total answer becomes 7, 2, Five, two. Yes. And you know that we are adding one. By tradition, we add one to the characteristics here. That becomes, we count from three here. One, two, three. We stop here. Therefore, our answer becomes, our total answer becomes seven, two, five, point two. See, that's the main answer to this question in the book. So it's quite simple, it's not hard, it's very very simple, if you look through it, you discover that it's very 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 easy. We've made it easier for you to understand, in case you still have any questions, 
don't fail to go on the comment section and let us know that let us know from which where you want us to solve from the minutes of where you want us to solve from i'll be leaving this third question for you to solve try and solve it and drop your answer on the comment section and be sure to review them to be sure you are actually actually really really following what we are doing in the next video we'll be doing an intermediate question as regards to algorithms using their table i will mention the very christian the lead mathematics teacher the premium Hill academy I'll see you in the next video guys premium hill academy morality ingenuity and excellence at its peak